हेलो एंड नमस्ते वेलकम बैक टू येट अनादर सुपर एक्साइटिंग एपिसोड ऑफ ऑफ बीट साइकोलॉजी हैव यू एवर वंडर्ड व्हाई यू डोंट रिमेंबर द फर्स्ट फ्यू इयर्स ऑफ योर लाइफ एंड डू यू वांट टू नो व्हिच इज दैट वन वे थ्रू व्हिच यू कैन ट्रैवल बैक इन टाइम एंड गेट टू सी द टाइम व्हेन यू वर बोर्न द इमोशंस दैट योर पेरेंट्स एक्सपीरियंसड व्हाट योर मम्मी एंड डैडी वर वेयरिंग ऑन दैट डे व्हाट यू वर वेयरिंग व्हेन यू वर बोर्न इफ यू डोंट हैव द पिक्चर्स टू सी and so on then watch this episode till the end because in today's video i will be answering why we don't remember the first few years of our life the phenomenon of not being able to remember the first few years of our life is known as childhood amnesia or infantile amnesia in psychology amnesia means forgetting and childhood amnesia means forgetting your childhood now there are several theories in psychology which offer an explanation as to why childhood amnesia can happen For example one theory says that a child's brain is not completely developed due to which a child is not able to form any type of memories another theory says that adults and older children remember information because of language development since a child is too small when he is born he is not able to have that language development and therefore he is not able to form any memories but on the contrary there is a group of psychologists which says that if the child is not able to retain information if the child is not able to remember anything then how is it that the child is able to recognize his or her caregiver mummy daddy and other individuals surrounding him so i would say that different psychologists have tried to explain and give different reasons and theories as to why we don't remember the first few years of our life but to be very honest science still does not have even one concrete answer as to why we exactly don't remember the first few years of our life it is also said in one of the theories that infantile amnesia ends as soon as a child develops a clear image about himself his existence and as he develops language he starts remembering things from then on all right now coming to the fact that how you can travel back in time and see what exactly happened on the day when you were born who all were there and what all happened this can be achieved using hypnotherapy in hypnotherapy we can hypnotize an individual of course with his will and the person can be made to travel back in time and have a look at the time when he was born and what all happened at that time so i hope you found this video to be very interesting if you did so please show some love and support by subscribing to offbeat psychology where you get lots of offbeat information thank you so much for watching i'll see you soon in my next video bye